What it do, gang? It's your boy, man, man, so crazy TV. Back again with another video, man. Salute to the notification game, man. Y'all smash that like button for me, man. Man, today, we're going to talk about two people that I know Rollo and Shine and Bilza, Black Youngster, one step against, man. He wouldn't mess with these guys right here. And these people out here, out his own hood right here. Like, Youngster used to be a vice lord before he started screaming blood. Whatever, so... You no, know, these guys right here, they certified members. You know what I'm saying? The body, you know, uh, salute to all them guys. R.P. Rich Lord, man. But uh, I said that to say this, man. Like, it wasn't just Dolph going through shit with these boys. Man, that man, he just stepped on. Y'all should have stepped on so many toes, bro. Not only that, man, that nigga got people... All in Atlanta that were gonna slide behind him on Dolph, you know, the dude Rollo. Not Rollo Rodriguez, I'm talking about Rollo Fam Goon, you know, 1017, you know, ah. He wasn't gonna play with him. I'm gonna let y'all listen to what this boy here gonna say. Oh, well, I wanted to turn up. Gonna be a whole nother year, man. They ain't trying to come in the year on no beef shit or no bullshit. The only reason why I cussed the fuck nigga out here because he got on Instagram talking about some any fuck nigga run away from me shall not prosper. Pussy nigga, you don't see all that money over here, nigga. I have prospered in in in, in the biggest way, nigga. Man, nigga, I own my motherfucking Lamborghini, nigga. Got my motherfucking title somewhere right here. Oh my life we're getting it down. I don't got no loan on none of my motherfucking car dog. You see that motherfucking title nigga? That title say to real David boy. I'm beginning. That's my car nigga. My shit cost three, four hundred thousand nigga. I can sell that bitch. I own my jewelry. I own my masters. I own my money, I own my apartments. You hear the motherfucking workers out there working on my shit? You hear them saws of shit, nigga? Even my apartments, I own my shit. Somebody in a nigga against him should prosper, nigga. I, I prospered, dog. I'm very successful, nigga. You smell me? With that lame ass shit, nigga. I'm counting millions every day. So don't even throw me under the bus like I'm not gonna succeed in life. I have succeeded. Happy with what I got. Very happy. Don't give a fuck about if I make it any further in life, dog. I take care of all my partners. I bought my mama house, my girl house, my kids, everybody around me, cars, everything. You smell me? So, like, don't, don't even throw me under the bus. Like, like all right, man, dog, I'm straight, dog. I'm very straight. I'm very happy. I'm very comfortable with myself. I love, I love. If they don't love me, you smell me? So, I, think I, I think I touched on enough. If it's anything y'all feel like y'all want to ask me a question about, then ask me. Because when I get out this motherfucking live, you know I ain't going to get back on this motherfucker in a minute. So, do it good. Very well, you smell me? Can't he be on my city? I mean, shit. The thing about beef is like beef ain't really for social media. You know what I'm saying? So like if it was anything I wanted to really do to the nigga, y'all wanna know. I wouldn't even put the fuck nigga on my Instagram if it was to the point where I was finna kill the nigga. We might slap him or beat his ass or some shit if we see him if he on that old fake tough guy shit. But nigga ain't nigga ain't really on that dog. I come in peace, dog. I come first with Asalaamu Alaikum. May peace and blessings be upon you, dog. I ain't come on the bullshit. But when you get on Instagram, this old fake ass rah rah shit, talking about some any fuck nigga against me shall not prosper. Man, come on, man. You gonna steal Dolph words? 
Man, Dolph said that about all them bust ass niggas that shot him, dog. Don't steal my partner line. Y'all niggas do that old switcheroo shit. One day y'all nigga cool with a nigga, then the next day you ain't. Don't say you don't know me. Fuck nigga, you went no fake time with me. With the jeweler. When we were getting my grills and shit, you got your grill. I said I like your shit. You you said you could fuck with them. I, you know what I'm saying? And now you get on Instagram and say you don't know me or the promoter. One thing about it, fuck nigga, everybody know me. Shit, I got almost 700,000 followers. That's very close to a million motherfucking people to know you. So don't even come on come on Instagram with that old fake ass shit, dog. I don't even want to beef with none of you niggas. I'm really trying to goddamn clean my face up. I'm trying to come in motherfucking and New Year the right way. But, dog, I, I got to tell you. I, I, I got to tell you. If if if, if y'all want to take it out, then I'm surely going to go the whole ride. The whole ride. I don't give a fuck what it take. Every dollar I got, I would spend... I would risk my whole motherfucking life trying to get revenge. A nigga ain't mad. Listen, if I die today, they gonna remember me as a real nigga. I will not be remembered as a fuck nigga. I will not be the man that was going hard and ended up one day south. Nigga, I'm going hard in the wheelchair, nigga. They gonna say that little nigga in that wheelchair tried to beat that nigga ass. Shoot, I ever go. I go on a high speed chasing the wheelchair, nigga. Roll that motherfucker. So that that that's just that's just me. If you wanna know more about my character, I'm a real stand up dude. I believe in Allah. I believe in motherfucking myself. A nigga ain't gonna try me and get away with it. At all. Never. Let shit slide. We ain't letting shit slide over here, boy. Let me totally fucked up, dog. See, right there, he was talking about Money Bag Yo. You know, if y'all don't know him and Money Bag Yo did a show, you know, back in the day in Florida. Soon Money Bag Yo. Rollo got added to the show late. Soon Money Bag Yo found out about it. He was trying to pay the promoter 10000 to not let Rollo up in there. Because he know they had been going at Dolph. And Rollo was a dude that really loved Dolph, like, naturally. Anybody that know Dolph know that. I mean, I mean, no, Rollo know that he really, really loved Dolph, just like Gucci. So that's why Gucci and Rollo them going to still keep his name going. Like, for real. Like, when when PRE was up in Atlanta, the boy was well protected, man. Rollo, he run his session in the bluff. If y'all don't know him, go look him up, Rollo fam. Go on. He uh, he got a couple bangers with Future. He got his own money and everything. You know, he uh Gucci ended up signing him. He locked up right now and got caught with like two two, three million dollar worth of weed on a PJ, private J. Young nigga having thing, young age, like for real, and ran a whole nation by itself. You know, he had his partner in him out there, but Everybody respected him. Young boy, like he was respected throughout the industry. Birdman, everybody. Like, he on a couple songs with Birdman. You know, y'all check him out, though. For real. But I'm going to let y'all listen to this other recording, though, that before Dolph and Money Bag and them, and that y'all seen them were hating on them. And yo got it with throwing shots. You know, let y'all listen to this. Like, all it, you know what I mean? Yeah. And I still ain't got no tags, bitch. Yeah, you know what I mean? I be mad at me too, bro. You feel me? I be mad too. Nope, hell no. I ain't finna play that part. They always trying to uh demonetize somebody when they hear that music in the background. But anyway, back to the uh b -b 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 black youngster. Hey man, I'ma keep this shit G, bro. Dolph, you a bitch. You a soft ass nigga. You nice ass nigga. If you got a problem, nigga, say you got a problem. Shake ass, bitch ass nigga. And you ain't no motherfucking king of Memphis. You ain't king of South Memphis. You ain't from the city, bitch. Yeah. They thought I was gay when I said free my nigga. Y'all did it. 
Yeah. Hey, man, we here, baby. Hey, look, uh -huh. how we doing it, baby. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? This shit big, man. This shit getting bigger than ever, yeah. baby. You know what I'm talking about, man? Yeah. Hey, man, yo did it, yeah. man. Paper route, yo did it, nigga. And it's what yeah. it is, nigga. Hey. Stop it, cuz. Where you at, dog? Where you at? Where you at? We in Cash Stadium right now. We just left the stove. Hold on, y'all. I just wanted to stop right because of a retarded mouth. Where you at right now, though? Where you at right now? Where you at? Where you at? Where we at right now, cuz? We in Cash Stadium right now, cuz. What down, Fred, cuz? Where you at, cuz? Where you at? Where you at right now? Where you at? 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 See the level of that? You see me? Hey, hey Bino, what's up, bro? Uh, where you at, man? Builder, what's up, bro? What's up, man? ATL Soho tonight, movie time. We just a little hot of my boys, dirty boys. Yo! Hey, as you can see, man, Dolph won't worry about no, none of them niggas, especially up in the A with Rollo right there, man. Hold on, my phone ring in the background. Hold on. My bad, my bad. I'm back, but um, yeah, Dolph won't worry about nobody, man. Like, he would love, you know, when you love a lot, it's somebody gonna hate you, man. You gotta keep a hater with a child. But I'm gonna end this little part right here with uh, when Rollo was going at back youngster and money back. Then that one of them boys say nothing to him, tried to play him. Let's get into that right now. I'm sorry, y'all. He's a super bitch ass nigga. Or should I say it in his voice? He's a su 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 super b -b 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 bitch ass nigga. I'm ready for your hundred shots or whatever you want to bring, fuck nigga. Or you can tell your you can tell your manager, I give him ten thousand dollars right now. He can come over here in Pakistan and I give him ten thousand dollars right now for your whole ass to take that picture down. I'm trying to bring black men to the motherfucking religion and you over here playing with God. You think Jesus wanted to be crucified on the cross, nigga? Jesus didn't want to be up there, nigga. He was forced up there, nigga. Did you read the motherfucking Bible? Oh, y'all fuck, nigga, just playing with God like this shit's on to play with, nigga.